Yo, what is up guys? I hope you're having a great day. So we're actually in LA right now. We're here in, here in the studio. So later today, well, actually not later today, but later in this vlog, we are going to take an epic trip to Six Flags Fiesta, Texas. But first, I wanted to show you guys the intense workout that I did to prepare for this Six Flags trip. All right, actually not. Nah, just kidding, guys. I didn't actually do a workout to prepare for this trip. But if you were to do a workout to prepare for an amusement park trip, this would be the workout. And I'll show you guys why. All right, it's going to be a fun workout. We're going to Gold's Gym Venice. So enjoy. All right guys, so the number one thing we need to make sure we incorporate in our amusement park workout is safety. You guys might think I'm over paranoid, but I've heard stories about people straight up falling off of roller coasters. So if those straps break or the bars lift up or whatever, we gotta make sure we can hold on, man. And that's basically grip strength and like pulling muscles, right? So we're gonna be doing a back day today. The optimal workout for roller coaster safety. So yeah guys, if you make sure to get stronger on your back workouts, right? Increase the grip strength, increase the, the pulling muscles, you'll have less chance of dying when you're on a roller coaster. Part of going to an amusement park is, you know, playing those like dart tossing games or like those ring tossing games, right? To basically try and win some prize that you could just buy at a dollar store, you know what I mean? Basically spend like a shit ton of money just to, to try and win a prize that you could basically just buy at a dollar store. But it's fun. So I think that the key to those games, right, you have to have strong stabilizer muscles, right? You don't want your hands, you know, shaking everywhere, right? So the way to build up those muscles, right, is to do free weight exercises. So today we're going to be doing way more free weight exercises than I would normally do. I'm training back. Let me back study your back. Let me oh. study your back. Okay, let's do a double bicep with sound effects. Bam! Now lat spreads for your pants. That's talent. That's I talent. That. We're going to like a, an, an amusement park okay. later. Yeah. And we're doing like exercises that would help us. And we saw you doing that, and we were like, Yo, if you if you're like falling off a roller coaster, yeah. right? Yeah. And you have to like pull yourself back up. Like that's perfect. This is uh, th this exercise has one utility. Mm -hmm. It's so that you don't throw up on the roller coaster. If you exactly. throw up, because if you throw up, then you know at 60 miles an hour, 80 miles an hour, the vomit's going to hit the person behind you. Right. And then when it goes inverted, if the if the safety mechanisms malfunction, it's you and gravity. Right. But if you've done this enough times, you and your vomit remain intact. Exactly. So do you want to do a set? Oh, you want me to try it here? Sh show me how it's done first. Fuck. Ah. Oh, shit. I might try for like 10. I'll just do 10. I am, man. There's no, there's no dying on the roller coaster anytime soon, man. I appreciate, I appreciate, it, dude. All right, guys. So at Six Flags, 
there is a water park. If you know me, I'm definitely going there because I get to be shirtless and you're not even being a douchebag being shirtless to the water park, right? So, gotta make sure the pump is on point. Gotta make sure we're looking as muscular as possible. So, the keys to the pump, right? The pump, right? Get the blood flowing in the muscle. What I like to do, one is drop sets, right? Um, I'll show you guys that. And then isometrics, right? So right after the exercise, I like to squeeze the muscle for like 10 seconds. The pump is unreal. So we're about to get a crazy bicep pump going. Let's get it. Let's go see how that pump is looking. Alright man, I think we're ready to go. Let's uh let's get this six flag trip going, man. Where's all the how is he sleeping on a glorious day like today? How long? Um, yeah. oh, <laughs> wake up, bro! We're going to Six Flags, baby! Bro. We're going to Six Flags! Oh. We're going to Six Flags! What the fuck are you wearing, bro? Oh shit, dude. Dude, they make you more aesthetic, bro. What the fuck? Look at those fives, baby! We're going to Six Flags! Let's go! We're going to Six Flags! Alright, guys, so if you have not figured it out, we're headed to Six Flags today. It's Alejandro's birthday. That is a special occasion. Happy birthday, Alejandro. Thank you, guys. We highly appreciate him, so we wanted to go to Six Flags today. All these fools, they wanted to, like, they want to do something weird, man, like go to a strip club or like a casino or some weird adult shit like that. Nah, man, I wanted to go ride a Ferris wheel, you know what I'm saying? We're going to go have some fun. Maybe we might meet some girls, bro. I don't know. I don't know if I want to call it too early, but we'll, we'll try and incorporate some fitness stuff too. If you guys don't know, Six Flags is a freaking amusement park and water park, bro. We're going to get, it's going to be crazy. Apparently, Phil back there, you might know Phil. He's, he's also known as the Muzz God. Some people know him as the Muzz God, but anyway, apparently he's going to do some kind of podcast and I'm lucky enough to be in it. Phil, where do they find the podcast, bro? They'll find the podcast on SoundCloud. Connor Murphy's gonna be a feature. All right, that'll be 200 bucks. But anyway, we're gonna promote the SoundCloud link in the description, so yo, go check it out. I'm gonna, apparently I'm gonna be talking, so who, who knows, it could be interesting. Yo, all right guys, pro tip, not only, not only does sunscreen keep your skin safe, but it's also nice and shiny. It's just like like an oil. Like, man, it brings out the definition, you know what I'm saying? So sunscreen, man. Even if you're not, you don't care about protection, bro, do it because of the aesthetics, man. Just watch this. I'm just gonna put it on here. It's nice and shiny, man. It brings out those cuts, you know what I'm saying? But also, bro, you definitely don't want to have those tan lines, man. Tan lines are not aesthetic. Sunscreen, man, I... It's just, it's just so important. I'm just gonna spend like a minute talking about it, you know? Side of the entry plaza. Yo, bro, dude, yo, yo, I just saw some yo, yo. You know when, uh, like, they take the pictures of you on the roller coaster? Yeah. Bro, let's go, let, let's, like, get on the roller coaster and, like, flex for the picture. Oh, shit, it's like, when it's going down, like, you flex on it? Dude, let's do it. So we're gonna all flex, right, and then Phil, you be filming the roller coaster ride. Let's get it. What is up, guys? We're starting out with the Goliath. Apparently, like, Goliath's a big dude, man. I'm thinking that this will help me make some gains, you know what I mean? At least get the adrenaline going, get some those anabolic hormones flowing, you know what I'm saying? Get the pump going. Not a lot of people know about this key point, but before you go on roller coasters, man, you gotta get a pump in. What, what's the reason behind that, Alan? Or why do you, why do you gotta get a pump in? Oh, dude, because the fucking pump helps with, like, the... The pump helps with, uh... 
Actually, bro, there's, there's not really any reason. I just want to take my shirt off and do some crazy shit, you know? It goes different speeds, man. What? No, it was nothing, man. Like, I, I didn't even feel like I moved. Like, you know, you saw me screaming, right? I like, definitely heard it from like a mile away. Carter, how you feeling, man? Good, bro. We got to flex for all the girls on the ground, you know what I'm saying? Oh, fuck. Oh, why is this off, dude? Look at this, Jeremy taking off his shirt, showing off the aesthetics. That's how to do it. That's how to do it. I haven't even taken off my shirt yet. But we're about to go on the Rattler. Wait, bro, like, are you are you allowed to go on the ride shirtless? Nah, not because of the shirtless, because of your like issue. Take our shirts off. Yeah, because that's, yeah. Oh, no, you can't take a shirt. How about that, man? Okay. No, you're good, man. Oh, which one is it? Connor something. Oh, Connor no, that's him. See, y'all, they're fucking with me, man. You got you, you, Dude, can you're I get with you, right? Yeah, for oh, sure. Oh, they're bro. fucking with like us. Oh, oh, my gosh. Thank you so much, bro. I, I know. want you to sign my basketball. I know. I wish. I want I want to, bro. That'd be sweet. Right. Yeah, well, we'll stay here, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bro, these guys are motivated. They're determined. They are not giving up. They are not leaving this park until they find a Sharpie so I can sign their basketball, man. Who has a better fan base than that, man? Who the the Murphy and Army? We need to find a good name. We need to find. Hey, ah. okay, hey. Oh, this is good. This is a good opportunity. Yo, I don't know what to call you guys, but I want a cool name for you. What should I call you guys? Murphians is is no. It's cringy. It's bad. Murphians no go. But something like that that I can call my viewers. Let me know in the comments below, and the winner will get a pat on the back. It's a lot of pressure. All right. <laughs> Always stay hydrated, guys. No, seriously, bro, tip, man. I'm fasted right now, so I'm like burning fat, and the more hydrated you are, the easier it is to burn fat. I don't even want to drink water right now. It's too cold, I'm not even thirsty, but I'm drinking, man. All right, guys, so we're taking a break. Everyone here is eating a bunch of shit food. Actually, those, those turkey legs might be kind of macro friendly. But I'm actually fasting. I've been doing intermittent fasting for a while now, so I usually eat between like the hours of like four and midnight. Actually, today it's going to be probably a lot longer. Not, we're probably not going to get home till like midnight, and I probably won't eat till then. But yo, 
fasting has a lot of benefits, and you guys should not be worried about like not eating for an extended period of time. A lot of people think that like your muscles will start like wasting away. Your body doesn't go into like starvation mode until like you don't eat for like 48 hours. If you guys are doing something where it's like not convenient to eat food or not convenient to eat a healthy food, like just go ahead and fast, man. Like. I'm probably gonna fast for like 20 hours today. Like those are really beneficial. At first, intermittent fasting, you might get hungry, but after you do it for a while, you, you won't even be hungry. Like I'm not even hungry now. It's two o'clock in the afternoon and I'm not even hungry. What I really like about it is that like clears your mind, right? You don't have to worry about food. Like these guys, man, who are like, shit, I gotta eat. They gotta, they gotta take time away from like, like these guys were like me, man, we still be riding roller coasters, but no, we gotta think about all this food. So no, that, that's one of the reasons I like it is because I don't have to think about food until like way later in the day. Bro, are you good, bro? Can't <laughs> Almost made it, dude. Look, look at this. All right, we'll see you later, bro. All right. Me and Alejandro about to do a pose off. So this guy right here, I'm jealous, man. Honestly, like he just started like working out consistently, and like he's seriously already this big. Like he has better genetics than me, like by far. So he wants to see how he compares. I guarantee you, he'll catch up with me in like a year. Like that, and that's like a short time period a for year. bodybuilding. That's a short time period for bodybuilding uh, for like bodybuilding standards, right? All right, let's do the pose off, bro. Wait, so why are you guys at Six Flags today? It's her 19th birthday. And no way! Yeah. It's actually Alejandro's birthday too, it's his 23rd though. So he's a little older, but... Hell yeah, are you having a good birthday? Yeah. Hell yeah. <laughs> 